Let's leave it in. And we're back yes. with the K1 World Grand Prix 2020 Japan Fukuoka at the Fukuoka International Center. We've got some action here at Super Featherweight. In the red corner, Hirotaka Asahisa taking on. In the blue, Tatsuya Oiwa. I'm Brian. Brian Let's get into this. So the height in the youth goes to Hirotaka. He's four centimeters taller and he's four years younger, 24. Yes, and he's also the older brother to one of my favorite fighters at the moment, uh, Taiyo Asahisa, who is on a, a run right now in K1. Um, but they say his brother here, Hirotaka, is even better, so we shall see. He's fought in Crush in the past, but recently he's been doing a lot of fighting over in China, so now making his return back to Japan. And this is a uh, rematch or revenge because these two fought back in Crush three years ago. Yes. So there's a uh, unfinished business on the table. Yeah, and I, uh, I love the style of Asahisa. These guys combine just very cool elements of boxing, head movement, cross guard, shoulder roll. Um, on top of like an amazing kicking arsenal influenced by karate. So it's very unique. Very unique indeed. Things get a little bit clinchy and handsy in close there. Mm. Quickly re-establishing the range. They both have very similar records. Um, mm. Wow, Asis is just destroying the inside of their lead leg. Feel that in the morning. Yeah, one thing that you'll see uh, with, the, with the Asisa brothers is the stance switching, uh, which, you know, especially because they're so sharp from both stances, just is a, a real mess for the opponent, really hard to handle. Absolutely. At the moment, he seems to be a little bit more comfortable with his southpaw stance, but he is, he switches on a dime. He really does. Yeah, Known as the uh, Brown Bomber, I do believe, is his nickname. Mm. Well, and the thing is, he can bomb from the right hand, the left hand, the right leg, or the left leg. Such strong kicks, such strong punches. And look at that, just shifting in, and then boop, 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 doing some work, and then shifting back out. I'm loving the body work in Tatsuya right now. Um, he's living up to his nickname, Unchained. He's, he's unchaining here. Yes. He's trying to corner his man. Here we go. Well, and this is the range that he wants because he is a massive power puncher. Look at the way he slipped and just came in with the head. No regard whatsoever. Just straight in there. A little bit of a 90s boxer in him there. Yeah, if he can take a little bit of that kicking range, kicking range away from Asahisa, um, he can do more trading with the hands, uh, which I think he'll feel more comfortable with. Yeah, oh, sneaking the left kick up there. Great high kick. Man, and I, it's hard to believe this is the first round. This is this thing is just opened up wide right now. Yeah, both of these guys are going to tip the tap. They don't want to back down. But the better work comes from really attacking here early on. Yeah, such good pressure. Just when he needs to get out of the way, he just gets out of the way so he can re-establish his attack again so fast. His, he's kicking the inside of the lead leg, and then he's kicking the outside of the back leg, the two most sensitive, worst spots to get kicked on the lower body. He's targeting, it's just so mean, it's so nasty to watch. Absolutely, he's got cruel intentions, and then you see him use the left so lovely there, with the way he brings it down, brings it up, the way he uses good variety on it. He creates an opportunity with a shot, and then just lands it with the next one. Well, the thing with these, the Asisa brothers too, is they're so filthy in the ring. They're so nasty and mean in their fighting um, ability, but they're so nice. They're just such nice people. Well, you know, it's a, it's a mark of a good fighter, mate. The moment the bell goes, boom, they're uh, in combat mode. Oh, and look at that kick to the oh. back leg there. You can just feel it. You know, I'm sorry, Obi Wan. I'm sorry. But um, all that's going to do is spur him on to eat up that distance even more and get in there with those punches, which is exactly what he needs to do. Absolutely. I mean, if I was uh, Tatsuya right now, I'd be thinking about trying to catch Hirotaka on the way in and the way out. Mm. And when he's in there looking for more body, body work and uppercuts, I can go and be completely honest. Staying at that range is not going to work for him. Yeah, doing some work to the body could be helpful to just slow 
uh, I'll see he's in down because he's so sharp. So sharp. And look at the way he lets his hands go in close. I mean, just, just, just look at what's going on here. The variety of work, the work rate, just moving so fluidly through the gears. You know, I'm going to put it out there. If anyone watching this comes up with the game plan to beat one of these Asahisa brothers, <laughs> put in the comments, let me know. I'd, li I'd love to know if you're privy because I've got no idea, man. These guys are so good. They've got every tool in the toolbox, and you know what? It comes out of the toolbox seamlessly, Ooh. seamlessly. I mean, just look the way he does it. Just backs off, revolves to his side, re-engages, you know? Everything here just is so heavy and thudding, and Oiwa oh, doing some good work here, though, too, with the coming back with the kick, keeping the guard tight, landing some punches. Yep, yep, yep. He's game. He's coming forward. Mm. He's trying to get into range, but when he's getting in there, he's not having enough to come back with. He needs to start coming back with more. You know, and I think his legs are already a bit sparked as well, just from those kicks early on. You know, Asensi is doing great work early. Absolutely. And to be honest with you, it's probably slowed his man down. I mean, not so light on his feet now, Tetsuya. Ooh, that oh, looked like that hurt. Ooh, get, there, get, but, mm, get a bit nasty in there. Get a bit yeah. emotional. Definitely no love loss there. Absolutely not good body shot there. He's, he's seeking that liver. Ooh, that is just a heavy... He stepped in, he hopped in on that one. He put all of his weight, boom, into that body shot. Honestly, you've got to feel for, for the unchained. I mean, the brown <laughs> bomber here is just throwing bombs, but from every angle. I mean, you can't get a read on this guy's fight style. It comes at you from any which way, from any angle. Simple as that. No, well, that's the thing. You know, you're, when you're in one stance all the time, you know, there are certain angles that you can attack along. There are certain ways that you can set your setter line, you know, up to theirs. But when you now add the other stance, it's it's t twice as many angles. But the what your opponent has to read now is more than twice as many attacks because the possibilities are endless. You've just made it exponentially more difficult because the attacks that you can string together are so much more. Absolutely, absolutely. I mean, the amount of things Tatsuya has to think about now. He might as well just give up thinking, bite the gum shield, go forward. I mean, yes. right now, don't try and work this Rubik's Cube out. You've only got three rounds. There's no time to do that. He's got more tricks than a magician. Yes. It's time to just get in, close the range, get mean. Well, that's the thing, you know, the good thing for Oiwa is he's the type of fighter that can do that. But my gosh, man, oh. Hirotaka Asahisa is putting on a clinic right now. The work to the rear leg of Oiwa is just so dirty and nasty and so <laughs> effective. Watching it, I almost just want to say, all right, let's, let's not allow that technique anymore. <laughs> you're going you're gonna, to you're gonna pop his leg loose, man. Uh, it's hard not to feel sorry for Tatsuya right mm. now. I mean, I wouldn't want to be in his corner. I mean, what do you tell him to do? You mm. can't, there's nothing to tell him to do. Bite your gum shield, march forward, tuck your chin, and just yeah. try and land something, anything, anywhere. Well, you, you're exactly right. This is what he needs, like, what he needs to do is exactly bite down, eat some shots on the way in, push Hirotaka back. He needs to do a lot of pushing until he gets him on the rope, ropes and then just to unleash massive hooks from there. Eat up all that space. Anytime Asahisa wants to throw a kick, if he's getting pushed back, it'll take away some of the pepper. So all he wants to just push and drive and push and drive. Maybe use a little bit of the rugby training at in high school. That's it, 100%. But the thing that you've got to take into consideration now is here with Tucker, despite being the busier guy, looks the fresher. His oh. engine is amazing. Yeah, unbelievable. And, and as well, too, to switch stances so often requires more effort mentally. You've got to be more concerned about different angles and attacks, and it's really hard to switch a stance and then pick up the shots from there. So he's also exerting more just mental energy, but he looks so good. 100%, 100%. I mean, at this point, I mean, you know, you can't afford to hesitate against this guy. And each time he switches, he gives you something to think about. Hence, there's a 
There's a second of hesitation there. Well, he's like a revolving door because Oiwa will momentarily put some pressure on. All Asaisa does is step to the outside, either as an orthodox or a southpaw, and swing the door open. So Asaisa, Oiwa can never really put the pressure on that he needs unless he did it in the corner. He's got to corner him, and that's the only solution you've got for a guy like that. You've got to charge him into that corner, but unfortunately, I don't think he's got the gas tank to do it. Oh, man. I think he's literally just outgunned. Oh, well, you know, wanting to get heavy in there, put somebody on the front foot, but when he does that, Asahisa kicking real low on the leg and sweeping his foot out. Absolutely, and look, Kira Taka had his back to the corner there, and Tetsuya just could not get him back in there. He stood strong, and then just switched. Oh, Ooh, good slip. Look at the head movement he's showing as well. I mean, it's just like one of those computers that can just take care of a million equations at once. He is... Constantly thinking about defense, offense, and mm. how they integrate together is seamless. Oh, really Look good just adjustment now. there. Yeah, well, Oiwa, uh, unbelievably tough because he has taken some massive Dude. shots to the chin, to the body, to the legs, and he's just hanging right in there. Yeah, his mouth is open, a gate. Oh. He's just trying to suck in all the oxygen he can, like a, you know, like a, like a beast. He's, uh, He's running on empty here. Well, if there was one technique Asahisa hadn't thrown yet, he just said it was the front kick to the face. But now he's <laughs> he marked all the that boxes. Out exactly. <laughs> check, check that thing off too, man. Do you think that's what he does? He comes in with like a list, a shopping <laughs> list. He's like, right, the fight's not done till I've done all of this. Oh my gosh! Look at this. Oh, oh, he does again. oh seamless. You know, Tatsuya is so slow at the moment now, and he's down to a plodding pace, and you know, he's just, he's just fodder. He's just fodder for kicks and knees. Wow, and, and everything that he throws above the waist with his legs is landing. Absolutely, and look, even when he's leaning in close, he's not chucking his own shots anymore. He's in survival mode. Yeah. You know, Oliwa, just a credit to him to be able to survive and still be moving like he is. Um, masterful. <laughs> Amazing performance there from Hirotaka Asahisa. What a fight. Oh, Whoa. So impressive, so impressive. I mean, he's a machine. He's mm. an absolute machine. He, he's comfortable coming out with anything from any angle at any time and does it seamlessly. Seems like there's no fault required. It's just reflex. Mm. Well, and even there in the hooking exchanges, his head's just protected a little bit better. He's the one that lands the third and final hook. Like every exchange is so good for him. His hand's ready there to block the back fist. It didn't land, he had the hand up ready. Absolutely, so well drilled. Just so well drilled. Oh, look, at the, look, you can see the pain. Oh, what a treat for the fans. Well, and there you have it. A complete shutout. 30-27 across the board. Absolutely, 100%. There's no surprises with that decision. And, you know, Tatsuya, you, you can't really point to anything he did wrong. He was just outgunned from day one and done well to survive in my opinion. No, you're absolutely right. I mean, he he had some great moments as well. He was doing all sorts of things right and he was hanging in there. It was just, yeah, like outgunned, man. Absolutely. Out thought, out work, out. Well, he chucked the kitchen sink, went home, got the bathtub and it still wasn't enough. <sighs> yeah, unbelievable. I, you know, is it the, is it the, the training camp that these, uh, brothers do is it um, something genetic are they human like what is it I don't I don't know but there is something special um, with that with that Asahisa style man love these guys absolutely oh. absolutely it's so hard to do look at some of these replays here now the punishment he absorbed I'd be proud of that alone oh yeah I mean, if you're here with Taki, you're thinking to yourself, how didn't I get him out of here?
前日の計量の時にあにレベルの差を見せるだの、KO をするだの、散々言いましたが、やはり大岩選手は日本のトップレベルの選手でした、やっぱり世界で僕は比べてしまったんですけど、世界的にも僕の攻撃を立ってたのは、大岩選手だけだなと思います。大岩選手とはやっぱり何年か前に戦ったこともあってあのお互いあの SNS とかでフォローし合ってたんであの知らんけどとかいろいろ言ってたんですけど僕は大岩選手の強さを知っていますあのまた僕も大岩選手も頑張りますので応援よろしくお願いしますちゃんと末のは知ってます皆さんも分かったと思いますまた応援よろしくお願いしますオース、oh, and... What a nice guy. He just spent that whole time giving credit to his opponent. Absolutely, 100%. I mean, he went out there and completely dismantled a man and does nothing but sing his praises. Wow, that's class. That's, yeah. That's a real sportsman. Um, <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm embarrassed to be me because this guy is so amazing. I'm gonna go hide. God, don't look in the mirror for a week. <laughs> yeah. Well, and there you have it, the K1 World Grand Prix 2020 Japan, Fukuoka at the Fukuoka International Center. We will see you uh, next time. There's, there's no answer to that. There's no answer. It's called just being a better...